Emily Woods. I'm the member ambassador here at Tech Shop San Francisco. A very cool maker space that's open to the public. Anyone can come in and learn how to make just about anything with their own hands. Hi, my name is John. I'm an instructor here at Tech Shop and I'm also a consultant. I work with uh, plastics, I work with carbon fiber, composites, and uh, I also work with the vacuum farming. Hi, my name's Kai. Uh, I've been at Tech Shop as a member ever since 2012. Um, I became an instructor in 2013, and I use the vacuum former specifically for making ice cube molds uh, and chocolate molds. So we'll be using the 686 vacuum former here at Tech Shop in San Francisco. We're going to use this pattern that was initially conceived of for a uh, composites job. I'm going to repurpose it for a vacuum forming plug. They're going to need uh, a little bit of draft angle in order to be able to pull the part off the pattern. And so we're going to have a few uh, relief holes drilled around the base so that uh, we get good definition in here. And I'm going to put draft angle on maybe three to five degrees on the edges uh, on all four sides. So that way we can get the part off easily. The plastics will contract a little bit when they cool off and they typically want to grab onto the pattern unless you have good curves like this. So one of our more popular areas here at Tech Shop is actually our plastics area. It's very fun. Members can work with 3D printers, a vacuum former Formic machine, an injection molder, as well as silicon molding if they would like. Coming to Tech Shop, you can learn how to use a lot of tools, particularly CNC tools, which is for computer numerical control. Uh, that's just a long, lengthy term for learning how to use computer controlled tools. So what we can do here is we can uh, cut out a lot of shapes on very basic materials like uh, MDF, which is a very, very cheap material, um, and it cuts like butter. We're able to cut any shape that we design, and as we do that, we're able to make a positive mold to then make a negative mold with the vacuum former. As soon as we make the, the negative mold with the vacuum former, we're able to pour in ice so today, we used the new machine, the Formex 686, to automate our project. We went ahead and used the machine for the first time to understand how it coincides with the other machines, and went ahead and vacuum formed it and uh, turned the negative mold into an ice cube tray. So that's a really wonderful area where a lot of the prototyping begins here at Tech Shop.